Carol Giffen has given the most passive-aggressive congratulations to her old loose women panelist Andrea McLean after being shunned from her wedding. Andrea, 48, tied the knot with Nick Feeney on November 30, the fourth anniversary of their first date, and threw a huge party to celebrate with her family, friends and colleagues. And while many of her ITV co-stars were picked to spend the day celebrating the newlyweds nuptials, including Nadia Sawalha, Kay Adams, Linda Robson, Jane Moore, Sarah Khan and even relative newbie Stacey Solomon, Carol was nowhere to be seen. She snow spoken out about the NFI in her Best Magazine column. Not so subtly throwing shade at Andrea for being excluded from the big day. I'm ecstatic for them both, even though I wasn't invited to the wedding. She wrote. She looked radiantly happy, as did he, so it's all good. What's not good, though, is that Andrea's managed to squeeze in two weddings in less time than I've been engaged to Mark, which is a bit embarrassing to say the least. Ouch. Carol, 57, has been with her toy boy lover Mark Cassidy, 35, for years, and the pair got engaged in 2008 but have no far not managed to make it up the aisle. Katie Price was not invited to Andrea McLean's wedding, but other loose women co-stars pictured partying up a storm she's since battled breast cancer and had a mastectomy to remove one breast during her treatment, which left her balding as the grueling chemotherapy took its toll on her body. In a joint interview with Mark in 2016, Carol the real reason behind them stalling their wedding plans. Nothing's happened but I keep thinking the cancer will come back which is making me not do things," she told Bella magazine. I worry that it's coming back and then think, what's the point? Do you know what I mean? It's complete paranoia. I'm really scared that it's all just going to go wrong again. But in October this year, Carol sounded much more positive and confirmed they would be tying the knot in 2018. Of course, the wedding is still on. It's definitely going to happen next year. Although, to be fair, I have said that for the last five or six years, she told Best. Look, seriously. It's important to us, we've lost family this year. And that cemented that we want to be together and married. Carol admitted she's now got to narrow down her choice of three wedding dresses to one and said she may still undergo reconstructive surgery on her breasts before the big day. I might even get my boobs fixed. But that's major surgery, it's like three months recovery, she said. I'm not sure I'm ready yet. After that, I plan to spend my time with Mark, going on holidays and just having a really good time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.